So hello ladies and gentlemen, this is the first time I've ever done anything like this, so we're taking a different approach for it. So anytime I do random videos that aren't my usual Sunday, what I'm going to do is I am going to have this view because it makes it much easier for me to record and there's no exporting, expecture, and expecture. All I have to do is cut, edit, jobs are good, no extra, let's match the audio against the other video. No, none of that. So essentially what we got here, we've got some Japan mail. I have already torn it open and I have already removed any sort of confidential stuff because this was sent to me by my family in Japan. I love when they send me stuff. So my mother-in-law usually sends me gift packages quite frequently and I am very excited because I have two with me. I'm not sure if I'm going to split this into two parts, maybe one this week, maybe one next week. It depends how fast I get through it. You know, I have a tendency to talk and talk and talk and talk. So let's just see how this goes and let's just crack this open. And let's talk through some of it. The idea of this is as I go through any of it, if there's anything that captures your eye that you think, oh, I wouldn't mind seeing some more of that, then let me know and I can show you. It makes life a lot easier for me. And as for showing everything at the end, I will see if I can get a video that goes along like, and that shows it all. I might do it at the beginning or end, I might insert it wherever. You just have to watch the full video to actually see the full lot of things. But uh, if I open one and I feel like that's not for a video, I'll only show what's in that box and I'll show what's in the other box afterwards. Anyway, let's crack on and open this. Boom, ba -da -boom, ba -boom. Excitement time. I love getting this, it's so good. But anyway, I don't know which way to orientate it. So we've got this box here. <laughs> uh, and to be honest, I never thought to do unboxing videos because uh, I just, I don't know. I just get this stuff and I usually just put it in my storage and yeah, eat it. <laughs> but the idea, it does make sense. I mean, like, if there's something that's to capture someone's eye, because I don't always record everything I eat, of course, because we get so much stuff, it's just like, I record what I want to, if that makes sense, and then, yeah, anyway, yeah, talk enough, let's get this done. So, first thing on the agenda is one that I actually requested, and I knew this was coming because I wanted it, and basically, there's loads of these, and I will be getting more of these, and I will be doing videos on them, because I find them really, really interesting, and it is the Japanese garden, and it's not just Japanese garden, essentially, it's uh, candies that uh, you make into... Japanese garden so that should be really fun it's written in this one is actually written in both Japanese and it is written in English as well so it means I can actually do this uh, all you need by the looks of things is a microwave and a fridge so if you got one of those you can make a lovely koi porn bottle I'm going to uh, yeah so I really look forward to that I will upload a video of it do we even get the box as well I don't know we'll have to watch wait and see the video Ooh, exciting times. It's going to take me longer than I thought to do each one of these boxes. But some of the stuff we can graze past because it's just like not needed. So I'm going to chuck it behind me for now. Let's just see if we can keep it in the camera view. But my whole big fat body's in the way. <laughs> All right. So, next. Oh, looks like we've got multiples of these. See, I didn't know whether I'd just do it on my lap or do it just looking at the stuff. But then you don't get to admire this beauty. Anyway, so, this one, I can't read it by the way, so be lucky. But what I can tell you, I know what this is. Um, this even says at the bottom as well, so I know it's one, two, three. How many did it want to send me? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, five of the same. I'll keep one, I'll cut the rest of the five behind me. But what these are, is by Nishin. And this, if you remember the video that I did where I talked about the noodles and the origins of it, essentially, this is the origin of instant ramen since 1958. And it is um, essentially the original ramen noodle, which is actually a chicken flavored ramen noodle. And it actually, from the feel of it, has a little hole in it. So when you put it in, all you have to do is, you don't even have to uh, put this on the hob. Apparently, you literally just pour boiling hot water on top of it and put your egg in first, put it in boiling hot water, and there you go. You got your original chicken instant ramen. That's some old school stuff. Maybe we will do a video on that because I'm generally curious to actually see how it tastes. It's either three minutes uh, with boiling hot water or it's one minute on the hob. So you can choose to choose the hob. Anyway, that's some good stuff right there. Anyway, actually, I might get through this quicker than I thought because, yeah, a lot of the items are bulky. This one is another Nishin one and it's more noodles but this looks like a spicy one it's like a spicy miso base maybe 
But look how fancy that looks. That looks so fancy. This is what I love that. And it looks like you get two in a pack, which means that's one portion for me. And it's called Gulby, but it's a um, Nishin one. So that should be interesting. Looks very spicy. It's four spice out of five spice. And the three little shock thing. I am not sure what that is, but I can ask and find out. But yeah, it's meant for two people. That's what that two something hit off means. I know what the second symbol means. Christ. All right. Oh, we got another duplicate. And it is two ramen pots. Look at these two. Do you like my breasts? <laughs> Big saucy breasts. Right. Uh, these are actually um, Ichiran ones. Yeah, Ichiran. Uh, Ichiran is a restaurant, a chain, and obviously they do their own ramen noodle res uh, ramen noodle pots as well. So these are all going to be good. I know these are going to be good. And I can actually read that bit there. It does actually say tonkotsu. It does look like tonkotsu flavored anyway. You can usually tell tonkotsu flavored, which is your, obviously your pork bone or whatever you call it. Absolutely delicious. My favorite flavor of ramen noodles. And these are by Ichiran, which I've eaten at Ichiran in Japan. And it's a fantastic place if you want ramen noodles. I, to be honest, when I go back to Japan now, I think I've eaten so much ramen that I don't choose to go to ramen noodle restaurants because I would say these are close to what you're gonna get in a restaurant, except usually bigger and usually the broth's a bit nicer and the noodles are really, really nice and fresh. But a good alternative if you can't get to Japan, well, if you can order them anyway. These are usually quite expensive with these ones as well. So, absolutely delicious. Looking forward to these two boobies. Next. Uh, oh. Three, let's do these, okay. We got a cup noodle, quite a standard one, this one. This is a seafood flavored one. Uh, it's celebrating their 50th year anniversary. And I don't know if you actually know, right, but actually the 50th year anniversary of Nishin, uh, they've actually released a drink, which is like ramen noodle broth flavored. I was asking if I could get it sent to me, but drinks are a bit more problematic. But they also do give you ramen noodles as well. So it's a shame because I would love to try those ramen noodle, like curry, broth fizzy drink oh that sounds so lovely but yeah this one's um a seafood flavor but not only that we've also got what are you doing there we've also got a red seafood so this is like the spicy alternative maybe we could do a video on these two comparing what's better the standard one or the spicy one i've got a feeling i know which one's gonna be better if you know me by now i love spicy food next we have another cup noodle uh, I have, was told pre in advance that this is actually a brand new one. So it has just been released. So I will be doing a video on this because, yeah, hit the popularity while it's still early. But it's this one. It's cup noodle and it is spicy or something. I don't bloody know. But it looks absolutely delicious. Chili flavored or something. It looks spicy. It looks delicious. Check that out. Ooh. Ooh. I'll just get quivers thinking about it. And next we have two more, which are this one. So I recently sent one of my friends one of these, but it's not the same one. I sent him a kimchi flavored one. It's a, it's the Nishi, Nishin Ra. Oh, I can't pronounce that, but it's Nishin Ra. And it's got a big piggy on it. That's how I recognized it, because it's just a piggy. But this one apparently is a spicy flavored with like fat on it. <laughs> a garlic. I'm not sure if it's going to be as garlic as the other one we had, but oof. It'd be interesting. Uh, these ones are usually really good quality, so I am looking forward to that. It looks, I mean, look at that. Does that not just look divine? I just literally want to ditch, smash my face into it and eat it now. Ooh, come to me, little biggie. Ah, uh, yes. This one is a Nongshim one. Now, we only really get a couple of Nongshim ones here. They're Korean ones. The one that we know is the Shin Ramen one. And this one is Ja Ja Men. I think it said Jar Jar Men, but it's, you usually get this black sauce and I think we've had it before, we cooked it before and it's absolutely delicious. So having this in a noodle format, yeah, it looks super cute. Really, really cute, really cool. It looks like it's actually got little people on it. How cool is that? Awesome, looking forward to that bad boy. All right, let's see the time. Box number one. <laughs> Done. Can I do a second box now? Nah, you guys are gonna have to wait. 
Wait until next week. All right. Thanks so much for tuning in, guys. It's going to be a nice quick video. I'm going to do some edits and hopefully keep it nice and short. And we should be moving to the next box. I'll be wearing the same t-shirt because I'm going to do it now because I'm so too excited to open it. And you just can't. You can't. You're going to have to wait until next week to see it. But yeah, unfortunately, that's the case because let these videos out. I usually do my Sunday videos as always. Any video like this that comes in between will be just coming as they do come in. Uh, I don't know when this is going to be uploaded, but the next one will follow a week exactly after that one because I like to keep some form of order in things even when they are non-ordered videos. But yes, I shall catch you again soon, people. Take it easy. Bye for now. Bye. See you later, alligator.